Established in the 1930s with a bed capacity of 30 as a dispensary for the treatment of majorly tuberculosis and other minor illnesses, the health center's services in Serede district have expanded over the years. However, the infrastructure has struggled to keep pace. The children's ward is the most crowded with between two to four children sharing a bed at a time while the caretakers have to sleep under the beds. Occasionally you find patients sleeping down, the ward beca be uh, the becomes small, especially children's ward. The children become so sick and then uh, a bed can be occupied by two or three children. Let the government provide more beds so that uh, that kind of sharing is eliminated because now diseases can easily spread from one child to another. By night time, more patients were still arriving in the children's ward despite it being full. This crisis has been made worse by a rise in malaria cases which have surged to 60% since 2022, yet the number of medical staff is thin. The patients who are, who are attending in that health center for Serere are beyond the, the capacity of health center for. We need a district hospital. The health center whose bed capacity currently stands at 90 after it was upgraded to health center 4 in 2000 receives patients from the neighboring districts of Buyende, Soroti, Ngora among others. Dr. Joseph Otim who is the in charge of the facility says they also have a shortage of essential medicines. Despite being designated as a health center 4 they often find themselves operating like a hospital. So supplies that we receive we receive for a level of health center for not for a hospital yet and uh, when patients hear that there are now drugs in the health facility even the numbers almost double in a bid to solve the shortage of space the district in 2016 embarked on a project of constructing new wards using local revenue but the project has stalled as the district leadership claims that the collection dwindled they are seeking help from the central government invited his excellency the president and he inspected and promised that he was going to direct uh, the Ministry of Health uh, to, to upgrade that health centre for to the district status. The woman member of parliament for Serere district, Helen Adoa, has vowed to pursue the pledges made by President Museveni in 2017 and the Prime Minister in 2022.